Good evening and a very warm welcome on Supercrats YouTube channel. Just imagine that you were thinking of getting something very, very important. And suddenly, one fine day, when you get it, you are not in the hometown. That is what happened with Swarlil Vargude over here. When he got selected in I am Indoor, he was in a camp with SSB for five odd days. And his parents were receiving the calls from Indore as well as from our site. Congratulations, Swanil, for making it big. And you know, Swanil is one of the three students who have already made into I am Indore. Supercrafts is expecting four more students will be making into I am Indore in upcoming four list. Just as you said, we have category wise uh, distribution. Tha. Four more students are going to definitely make into I am Indore very soon. And Swanil is one among those. Three students who have been nurtured by Team Supergrads. Warm welcome on Supergrads YouTube channel, Swan. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Okay, so we were not getting appointment because you were there in a network where there was no network area. First, pehla question from my side: How has been your journey with Supergrads till date? Sir, it has been the one of the most amazing journeys that I have in my life. Like uh, I just opted for the two-year short batch that was a one-month course. But in that one month, I felt like I wish I could have been with Supergrads for more than that for a whole <laughs> year batch or the two year batch which you uh, take. So it was really amazing. So I'm really happy that I joined the one month batch. Even you gave me your, the personal guidance for how you should prepare, what should be the, your schedule and all. So it was really, really an amazing experience. Sir. Okay, so who all taught you? Throw some light and what happened? If you can put some, throw some light on that journey so that, you know, yeah, students yeah. get benefited out of it. Yeah. Uh, so I had uh, like the teachers that taught me were An Anil sir, who taught me quant and Pankaj sir, who also taught me quant. Then for logical reasoning, I was, there was uh, Pankaj sir, uh, sorry, Karan sir. And uh, with, for English, the, uh, the uh, Brinda ma'am taught me. So all of them helped me a lot. Even Anil sir, in between, you know, like whenever there were classes going on, he used to tell us that this is how you should solve the paper. This is how you should go about it. Then he also used to motivate us that yeah, like just ek mahina baki hai pad lo, ek hafta baki hai pad lo, uske baad to maza hi karna hai. So that was really motivating because whenever you are studying for, you know, for so much time at a single time, you tend to get a little demotivated. But right. uh, the motivation that we were given once in a while really you made us do more than what we could so that was really good even in the classes whatever doubts we had they were solved on the spot even if we went like uh, if you're solving a question and we started solving another question but i had the doubt in the previous question there were no uh, there was no anger in that like why are you just still solving that or something they just uh, all the teachers they just used to solve all our doubts which we had so that was really great because yeah. i think personally that more than learning a new concept or more than solving questions, it's important that your doubt should be clear on the questions that you're already solving. So that was really done by Supergrads. A very important point being made by him. And in fact, you know, that's the thought process in and around it. Like you are not supposed to solve that particular question. You are supposed to solve that concept, which is which you're not getting. So uh, if you keep that thing in mind, then definitely it's going to help you a lot. So Swanil, most of the students are always afraid that they are in standard 12th and they have to, you know, study for something else as well. So yes. two parallel lines, how did you manage with standard 12th? IPM preparation as well as standard 12th. Both of them were the biggies, right? Yes, sir. So what I did was, while well, like uh, at the start, I was just uh, focusing on the IP mat. With that, I was just uh, studied a chapter or two of physics or chemistry. What like these were the subjects that I found a little difficult. So I used to do that. But when there was only one month left for my boards, I shifted my focus to boards. So I was doing my boards. And with that, every two to three days, I was revising all the formulas that I would need for IPM. All the, like I had made a formula book in which I had written all the formulas, all the concepts, all the tricks, all the tips. And even if I found some question which was a little difficult and which would help me clear up a particular concept. So I used to write, the, write, that, write that down in a notebook. So I just used to revise it in two to three days. And every two to three days, I also gave a mock. So I at least be in practice of that. 
so this is how i managed it but uh, in the end the boards cancelled so after that i was just studying for ipm okay <laughs> so i think all these points we have al- also told you in the strategy preparation so i i had already taken one uh, video on strategy preparation on ipm where we have mentioned about revision notebook where we have mentioned about taking mocks and how important is mock analysis we have also talked about that so you told your experience in the classroom uh, swarnil you also told me how did you manage standard 12th as well as ipm preparations together now it's time to understand what after ipm aptitude test so how your journey because you know 35% weightage is given to the interview part and uh, you know we have had some common memories over there so just start with your part what have been your memories in ipm interviews so the like i was also prepared for uh, i like the interview by supergrad too so the preparation which was given to us we covered every single topic like the hr questions we literally uh, discussed hr questions for 3 days and every to- uh, every topic was discussed like just ta- take it for example where uh, if we say what are your uh, career goals so in that sir used to give us an example like he used to analyze that particular example rahul sir himself taught us so he used to analyze the example like this is what you should write this is what you should say how you should how you should say it what should be the voice modulations everything like every aspect was covered by him and even the mocks which we were given it like there were no there was nothing like you will only get a single mock you will only get two mocks you can take as many mocks as you want till you are sure about yourself that you perfect do right. well yes sir <laughs> to like to bring the, uh, a person to a perfection so everything even the academic questions he used to tell that how you should study for that like i was a science student but still he guided me that uh, this is what you should study from the physics part this is what you should study for the from chemistry part what kind of questions they can ask for maths you should be thorough with graphs or you should thorough you should be thorough with your the calculus part because that is what you they usually ask so everything like there was not a single thing that i in the interview when the uh, real interview was going on i realized that there was not a single thing which was not covered by supergrads in supergrads in the interview sessions so it was a really great experience thanks uh, thankful to you for your feedback usually we guys used to give them the feedback and trust me on this you know the first feedback of sunil was not that good <laughs> so uh, you know uh, we if i am not wrong uh, you know we hum logo ne bahut dart lagayi hai students ko feedback part mein that you next time jab aaye so there should be a, there should be a different version of it and every time swanil when came on for the next round of the interview then he had a different version altogether and that what worked for him in the end if i'm not wrong and he may not be knowing it personally also kyunki kya hota hai when we are facing interview we do not know by hamare bare mein humko nahi pata padta so the person who is taking your interview is more confident about you so sonal has a graph rise of this when we were preparing him for the interview part okay so this was about the interview preparation part as well now most important because most of the students are listening to you for a very very important part you have cracked ipm indore you have cracked ipm rohtak as well let me tell you guys i think ranchi as well right so you have got yeah. so he's getting calls from entire all the iams are just looking after him right now uh, in fact the uh, 40 category rank the category rank of sonal is 40 so a very correct person to help you out with the strategy part so what was the strategy that you adopted in ipm preparation students who are preparing for 2022 and 23 are listening to you right now give them the firm strategy from your end Uh, so so what happened with me like was i started preparing almost 5 to 6 months ago uh, mm-hmm. like 6 months before the uh, exam date but i started solving the pearson book which was uh, which is only ipm oriented but when i solved it i realized that uh, it does not have the content uh, and the difficulty level which comes really which really comes into the ipm at examination so i started solving some cad books but uh, at that time it was like i really had a lot a, a very little time because the uh, by that time there was, i had only i was only left with a, a month so in that i was really pressurized like what i should do but i used to wake at night like my mom now makes me realize that it's not like you, you just got got into i am indoor you have been <laughs> studying till 4 o'clock in the morning so it has so, been a journey you know to cherish yes, yeah 
yeah yeah please continue. so all those things so i used to solve those questions and whenever i had some doubt i used to i used to disturb the, even uh, even all the teachers even at night they say you doubt solve kar do sari 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 doubt solve kar do even my friends had my number they were like bhai so ja abhi to bhi so it was a really fun <laughs> journey so that was what i did and i solved a lot of mocks okay. that was very important even in the mocks like uh, there was a point when in a, a week or something i wasn't solving uh, a lot of mocks so rahul sir personally called me ki why are you not solving mocks so he like you know the acha main usi waqt aaya hu phone karne jab tum nahi kar rahe ho waise kar rahe the kar rahe the acha ye jhoot bol raha hai yahan par waise bhi nahi kar raha hu they sir aapne to hamesha guide kiya hi but jab aapne like whenever kuch galat kar rahe hum ya mocks nahi de rahe to wo tab aapne bahut personal guidance diya ki yaar karo ye cheez important hai like you know better than us because you have been training students for years years on the end so your Uh, personal feedback really helped me so solving mocks and even uh, i was a little weak at english so i uh, tried doing a lot of grammar i asked brinda ma'am what we should do so he, she told me to how to improve my vocabulary how to improve uh, the like the, there are a lot of questions in which there are fl- phrasal verbs and brinda ma'am ki style hai maine dekha hai agar koi problem leke aata hai na unke samne and she comes up with a solution to it wo bahut acha solution hota hai like the solution is apt jo problem yes, hai uske sath wo lock in key relationship baith jata hai yes, so yes it's definitely clear concise so Haan. that's what it is it's it, like jo bhi problem ho even in quant i was facing a say facing some problem the but even anil sir gave me personal feedback like you should do this solve hmm. these questions whatever right. doubts you have just ask me so all that everything even the mocks which were there they were not like uh, they were not very easy mocks you had to really work hard only then you could score in mocks so all these things really helped me and that's how i prepared i guess with like i just gave my heart and soul to it i prepared so much that when i saw a question i knew that will i be able to solve it or not even what how much time will i take so i think that even the students which are preparing right now they have almost a year and even when the people who who will see this this video later i think that you should prepare prepare so much that whenever you see a question you should know that will you be able to solve it what time will you take you and should you solve it so everything should be clear in your mind and you should solve so many questions that when you see it you should be like i just solved this question i'm going to solve it under 30 seconds every question should go like that so that's what my that was my preparation strategy that be perfect in every aspect so that you can save time in your examination so there's a lot of depth in swarnil's preparation what i can infer from all the talks first is that he was very particular in giving mocks and analyzing them secondly you know ek pagalpan tha ki you know mujhe i am indore nikalna hai पहले सुपरग्राइड से सपोर्ट नहीं मिली लेकिन जब सुपरग्राइड्स मिल गया तो सेवियर के फॉर्म में एक आ गया और राइट देन व्हाट आई कैन रियलाइज ही वाज कांस्टेंटली कन्वर्सेशन मतलब एक इंसान को कोई लत होती है और चाहिए होती है वो चीज देन ही इज इनटू इट कंप्लीटली एंड दैट्स व्हाट आई कैन सी मोस्ट इंपॉर्टेंट जो लास्ट पॉइंट ही सेड एंड दैट रियली यू नो आई एम रियलाइजिंग इट राइट नाउ इट वाज नॉट ओनली सोनल सपोर्ट ही इज गिविंग द क्रेडिट टू ऑल द पीपल सो जो पेपर निकाला है वो स्वर्णिल के साथ साथ अनिल सर ने निकाला है पंकज सर ने निकाला है वृंदा मैम ने निकाला है राघवेंद्र सर ने निकाला है करण सर ने निकाला है कहीं कहीं मेरा भी कंट्रीब्यूशन है थोड़ा उसमें सो दैट्स व्हाट ही इज टेलिंग दैट यू नो आई आई रियली टुक द टीम फॉरवर्ड एंड दैट हेल्प मी टू डू दैट जॉब एंड आई एम थैंकफुल टू यू यू नो मेंशनिंग दिस थिंग बिकॉज यू नो दैट इज व्हाट द रियलिटी इज यू नो सो समटाइम्स यू नो एंड रियली वी चेरिज दिस पर्टिकुलर थिंग बिकॉज यू नो सम स्टूडेंट्स रियली स्पीक अबाउट इट this is a journey and journey is more important than the destination so there were many students jo ek number se roketa i remember that particular interview class jo scheduled thi and hamare shayad panch ya chhe bacche aise the jinka ek ya do number kam pad gaye the and they were literally weeping in that class so anil was also there in that class if you remember someone yes sir i do remember so they were weeping in that class and it was so difficult for us to continue that class but we did that somehow and we gave them that courage and we told them you know nahi abhi jang baki hai so no issues at all but yes it was hard for us also to understand that you know one mark or two mark when i had a conversation with pankaj sir anil sir and abrinda ma'am as well as sagwin sir on that 
they were so emotional they told me you know thank you rahul you took that class and we were not part of that particular thing so that is one aspect and we are becoming emotional last question of this particular interview what advice you would be giving them so you know bahut baar strategy se zyada advice kaam karti hai because you know yes, ek senior ne kaam kiya hai so kuch advice on students ke liye jo 22 ya 23 mein paper likhne wale hain and definitely it's going to be very helpful for them i'm sure because swanil has done it in a way we wanted him to do it yes swanil sir i would just advise them to listen to the teachers and work hard because there is always like uh, my father always tells me that there is always a person who is working harder than you so you should always realize that and work as much as you can solve as many questions as you can till you reach to perfection and just stay motivated it's not uh, even if you in a single single mock or you uh, score less don't be demotivated just try to do better in the next one so that's how you progress but you have to work hard you must work hard that's the only uh secret to success work hard all right so anil uh, let me tell you we all at the team is proud of you and proud of the speech in fact you know you know there are some tears which are very very fruitful for everyone and ye khushi ke aansu hamesha sabko aate rahe with that thought yeah. and uh, with all the blessings to each and every one uh, for ipm 22 and 23 thank you thank you sonil for giving your precious time just after this this became let me tell you and repeat this thing to you guys he was not in the town when results were out he was not knowing it in fact you know his mom called me up sir ho gaya and i was so elated with that particular thing thank you thank you swanil for giving me precious time